wash, let's do a craft. So for today, we're going to make your own jellyfish. In this case, it's going to be a paper plate jellyfish. So as you can see, you're going to need a paper plate. I've already partially colored mine in because we do have to cut the bottom part off. So, I mean, you could still color it in if you want, but it's not gonna be part of the jellyfish if you wanna cut it off to make it properly. You're also going to need two cutout circles. They don't have to be white, but for eyes, kind of makes sense. Or you could just draw the eyes by themselves. Up to you. You're also going to want something to color with. I used crayons. You're going to want scissors for cutting the plate if you choose to. And you're going to want pipe cleaners, which you may cut with scissors if you choose to. You could have glue, tape, or um, staples to attach the stuff. I mean the pipe cleaners. Or you could use liquid glue like Elmer's glue. And you could also use a Crayola marker like I will for the eyes. So let's begin. So first you take your plate and you cut off one third of it or a quarter, give or take, roughly that amount. You can cut in a straight line or you can cut it wiggly. Depends on the sort of artistic look you're going for. So this is going to be my top of the jellyfish. Then you can either attach the pipe cleaners with the eyes. I'm going to start with the eyes. So tape, glue, liquid glue, staples, whatever you want. I'm going to use glue. So you glue the back of it, and then you stick it on. Do the same thing with the other one. Since these are just white cutout circles, the back can be either side, doesn't really matter. Then you glue it on. All right, as you can see, mine is off center, but it's okay, because I am I like it. Then what you do is you take your mark and you uh, draw the, I guess this would be what? The other part of the eye. And this should be black, although it looks kind of green and the cap is brown, so it's very confusing. But it's okay, because it still looks nice. All right, so I have attached the eyes, looks pretty cool, now let's attach the pipe cleaners. So since these are long and kind of cool looking, you uh, gotta cut them in half. Or you don't have to, but I'm going to choose to. And I'm going to separate the colors so that there's like a pattern going on and then I'll invert the pattern and it's gonna be pretty cool so you just line them up I guess we can do it up and down kind of straight and then you just tape them in this tape is not long enough there we go and then you just tape them in and you're done. Now if you choose to, you could also give it a nose or not. I don't think there is anything left to do. So thanks for watching me do this craft. I hope you enjoy doing it on your own. See you next time.